guys, thanks for tuning in. Something different today. Well, first of all, I'm at Power Martial Arts and uh, just finished doing six rounds of rolling with Juan. Prior to that, I did a 6K run outside. So I'm pretty hot, pretty exhausted. But today's videos, I just wanna show you how I usually finish all my training sessions. So it's sort of a, a fire 15 round. It's five minutes of calisthenics and it's sets of 15s. So you'll see I'll be doing 15 burpees, 15 jackknives, 15 push-ups. And I'll be repeating that three times. Usually takes about five minutes. So have a look, challenge you, try it out, especially after your training. And then you're really done at the end of, of all this. I hope you like. What you're seeing here in this uh, five minute round of training is I just picked three exercises. These uh, exercises is just to give you an overall body workout. Uh, the burpees pretty much works just about everything. Um, but I also selected the jackknife so it's more of a core stomach exercise and the push-ups more for the upper, upper body strength. About the burpees, there are many different variations of burpees. I just selected the fundamental basic way without throwing a push up at the bottom or nothing, but just make every motion count and not take a shortcut. About the jackknives, well, you know, it's just making sure that uh, you bring your upper body and lower body up in the center to touch in the, in the middle. And about the push ups, again, many different variations. I just select the ones that have my elbows sort of rubbing my rib cage going all the way up and all the way down making the most out of all, all exercises. I call this the 5 or 15 round because uh, there are sets of 15 and halfway throughout the round it feels like you're on fire so uh, that's why I call it the 5 or 15 round. It's a round of 5 minutes and I'm able to do 3 exercises of 15 3 times. Sometimes I trick my mind and my body, instead of counting to 15, I'll count to five, doing quick sets of five, three times in a row. It's still 15, but somehow it makes it easier in my mind. You should give that a shot if you find 15 too big of a number. Doing this fire 15 round um, of training is challenging. I mean, it's relatively challenging if you happen to do it fresh, but if you wait till at the end of your training and then you throw in this fire 15 round, it's extremely taxing, especially if you're doing it with a wet gi. Because my gi is probably close to 10 pounds at the end of my training with how heavy it is. Um, it's just about like wearing a 10 pound vest. So if you really want to challenge yourself, do this at the end of training with a wet gi, or if you happen to be doing some stand-up training, still keep your mouth guard and your boxing gloves and your shin pads on. It's, it's a very taxing round. If you find three sets of 15 too taxing on you, maybe just do three sets of 10, there's a big difference and then 
reduce your weight to three sets to 15. Maybe three sets of 10 may take you three and a half minutes. So it's just, again, this is just a way to empty your gas tank completely. So when you're leaving the gym or when you're done your training session, you know you laid it all out that day and uh, you can feel good about yourself. So I hope you got something out of this video. It gives you an idea on how to empty out that gas tank when you're just completely done. You throw in five more minutes of the fire 15 round and uh, challenge yourself, do it after training. And I do look forward to your comments at the bottom. Thanks for watching.